Hey everybody, Ross Hill here with Play Wilder. Thanks again so much for your purchase. We truly appreciate it. We've been having a lot of fun building these things. It's been crazy, but it's been good. Um, so we are out here on a beautiful Colorado day. The sun is shining, the wind is blowing, but I wanna show you how to put one of your pieces together, to put your, your, your climbing gym together. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kinda show you some of the pieces here in a second. I'm gonna show you how to put them together. Now I will give you the fair warning. We provided an Allen wrench in your order. I'm going to use a drill, uh, but you're gonna understand exactly how to do this. So let's get started. Let me fix my blanket down here. Okay, so in this order, we have an arch and we have a triangle, and then we also have a ladder ramp. So the ladder ramp, you know, it's it's already fully assembled. You're not gonna have to do anything to that. The arch comes in two pieces and everything goes together with dowel rods. Now you'll notice on the end of your dowel rod, there's a threaded insert. Now the threaded insert essentially is what allows us to connect these bolts. So with every order, you're gonna get an Allen wrench and you're also gonna get enough bolts for your order. So what happens is when I put this together, I'll put the bolt through the hole and it will connect with your dowel rod. So now that's connected, okay? So essentially what you're gonna do for the arch is you're gonna go through the arch, you're just gonna connect the bolts with the dowel rods. Now you'll notice, this is actually really important. This dowel rod, is a little bit shorter than the dowel rod for the triangle, okay? So the reason that that's important is the number of dowel rods that are the same length correspond with what they go to. So the arch has nine dowel rods, the triangle has 13, and the cube has eight. So when you're setting this up, just make sure that you have the right amount of dowel rods next to your order so that you're not putting the wrong, the right, you know, a different dowel rod to a different piece. Um, so let me, so that's how you connect the arch. Pretty straightforward. You know, what I would definitely say though is keep it really loose. Okay. Don't tighten this up while you're, while you're putting it all together. Tighten it up at the very end. Okay. Keep it loose. Now here's the next thing. When we're coming to the triangle, people have had questions about how the triangle actually goes together. So I'm going to set a triangle piece out on the ground. Then I'm going to take a long leg. Now, I want you to notice something. On these two pieces, now one's obviously a long leg and one's a short leg, okay? Let me make sure my audio is picking this up. On, the, on both pieces, you're gonna notice that there is a small amount of space at the top of the piece and a large amount of space at the bottom. Now the large amount of space is the side that's gonna touch the floor, okay? So when you're lining these up, Make sure that the small amount of space is at the top and the large amount of space is at the bottom where it's going to touch the floor. So, you know, then you're going to do the same process. You're going to take a bolt. You're going to thread it through the outside of the triangle, through the leg. Then you're going to attach a dowel rod. Now, make sure you keep it really loose because again, you want it loose, and then once you have everything together is when you're gonna tighten everything up. So hopefully that gives you a pretty good explanation of how to put everything together. If you have any questions, we have a couple more videos, um, but hopefully that, that kind of tells you what you need to know. Also, don't hesitate to reach out to us for support. Again, we really appreciate your order. Hope you truly enjoy it. Let us know if you need anything. Thanks so much again. Ross Hill, Play Wilder.